Dajaha, hi guys, it's Shanae and welcome back to my channel and today I'm doing a video that shouldn't exist because I shouldn't have not made the mistake in the first place but we're here. So basically with Moonlight Chicken episode 8, I didn't realize there was an after credit scene and then I was luckily informed by my patrons who were like, there's an after credit scene and it's one that's worth like reacting to it. So please you know um and yeah that's that's what we're gonna be doing today we're gonna rectify my mistake from uh, not realizing that there is an after credit scene for episode eight and that is what we're gonna be watching today before we do get into it i just want to say a quick massive thank you to all my amazing patrons and channel members if you're interested in joining either of those for early access and uncut reactions to things like my chicken the links will be in the description below along with my social media and my peer box and if you want to subscribe that's always greatly appreciated but now without further ado, let's get into today's video. Oh, they're watching that. And it didn't work right originally. Me and Long. Oh, more loud, eh? Mommy, you can hear. Can I see ya? Well, if that isn't symbolic. That's a fair point. I'm assuming they didn't get the copyright for it. ไอ้ลุงบอกว่าพระเอกคู่กับคู่มั่นเนี่ยก็ใช่ไงผมบอกผมบอกว่าพระเอกแต่งงานกับคู่มั่นแต่ไม่ได้บอกว่าพระเอ
ไม่หลงลงผมไม่มีวันหวานเข้าหรอกผมเหมือนจะเที่ยวสวนสนุกแล้วว่าผมอาจจะแก่แล้วมั้งอยู่บ้านเฉยมากกว่าไม่ได้กล้าดูเกรงเรื่องเพราะว่า I do feel like it's addressing some doubts that Jim probably had, or well, obviously had. อาจารย์มันไก่ชั่วคราวแล้วเมื่อไหร่จะไปลูกจ้างไปจับมัน They just really like talking on subtext This song is stuck in my head อยากเป็นแค่ลูกจ้างจะได้เป็นไรแฟนแฟนพ่อค้าไงว่าไงลูกยินไม่ค่อยชัดเลยอ m sorry I'm I'm kind of a little bit speechless right now <laughs> I I'm a grown woman I should not be um, this flustered Okay, great. Uh, I, I'm glad we got this because I was wondering. But promotion declined. Reason I just bought a home. I don't want to move anywhere. Like that's a that's a very big thing to just casually throw in here at the end. But I'm really glad that they did address it at least. Oh. <laughs> I'm just feeling very fuzzy right now. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh goodness. Okay. Um, let me let me just gather thoughts again. My word. I will say it again. This is such a fantastic show, and I'm so glad as well. Like, cause a terrified part of me before I started reading the subtitles for the shots of the paper, I feared that. Um, They were. It was gonna like sequel bait in a way, um, where it would be like, oh, he hasn't told him about his promotion yet, or oh, he hasn't told him that he has to leave the city yet, or you know something like that. Um, so I'm so 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 glad that they went in like the completely opposite direction with that. Because um, it just it felt so perfect, um, and I really don't think they needed sequel bait for this. Whether or not they do make a sequel to it, um, I don't like. I don't even know if there is talks of a sequel or if this is very much a one-off. I I am happy either way, but I think it's always good to have a season be self-contained, and don't ruin it with sequel bait. Like please, because then if the sequel does not arrive. It feels incomplete. Um, you know, if a show is good enough, it can stand on its own, and then 
the audience will come if there's a season two. But yeah, no, this was wonderful. This was so perfect. Um, and it was just nice that they actually did tie up some loose ends here with the after credit scenes. It wasn't just, you know, wonderful uh, cliché-ness and silliness and mushiness. It was also just some like small things that I felt like it was okay that it wasn't addressed, but it's better that it's addressed. I don't know. I. I really like that. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this little add-on and otherwise, hopefully, I'll see you guys in the next one. Sajin!